Hi, kindergarten. Welcome back. I cannot wait to see what happens with our friend Llama Llama. So let's read our learning targets and we'll get started. I can ask and answer questions about important details in Llama Llama time to share. I can make connections between pictures and words in Llama Llama time to share. So when we left off yesterday, we saw Llama Llama get really angry because Nellie New was playing with his favorite toy, Fuzzy Llama. So let's see how they solve the problem together. A bit of thread and good as new, but this is what we are going to do. I'll put Fuzzy Llama on the stairs until you're sure you can share. Nellie's sorry. Llama too. It's time for something else to do. Maybe tractors? Maybe not. Like to dress up? Not a lot. Let's play kitchen. Make a cake. Nellie mixes, llama bakes. Look, our fancy cake is done. Hmm, what would make this game more fun? Fuzzy llama on the stairs. Llama thinks it's time to share. So look at Llama Llama's face. How do you think he's feeling about deciding to share? Yeah, I heard some friends say happy. I noticed that he has a smile on his face. It looks like he's feeling a lot better about sharing now than he was earlier. Playtime's over. It's the end, but Llama has a brand new friend. Nellie will be back and then Llama wants to share again. So it seems like sharing helped Llama Llama make a brand new friend. So why do you think that is? Why do you think that sharing helps Llama make a new friend? That's right, because sharing makes people feel good. It makes them feel welcome. It makes them feel happy. And it shows a lot of compassion. So your job is to draw a picture and write a word about how Llama Llama feels when he decides to share with Nellie Mew. So we'll go back to that picture so you can look at it again, it again and pause it if you need to. And I can't wait to see what you write. 